Today, two local high schools look to advance in the Lakeshore PBS annual academic tournament that we call Making the Grade. Who will advance to the semifinals? Will it be Andrean or Merrillville? <laughs> we'll find out next. This quarterfinal match comes your way on the other side of this short break. This is Making the Grade. From safer communities, to admirable performances. We power Northern Indiana, so you can do what moves you. This is season number nine of the Lakeshore PBS annual academic tournament that we call Making the Grade. I'm your host, Andy Schultz. Today, eight of the best and brightest students in all of Northwest Indiana look to advance their school into the next round of our tournament. What's at stake for the tournament winner? Well, the, of course, the coveted Making the Grade Championship trophy, as well as scholarship money generously provided by NIPSCO. This is a quarterfinal match. The winner to the semis, who will it be? Will it be Andrean? or Merrillville. We'll find out shortly. It's gonna be a great game, I can feel it. We'll take a moment to meet our contestants in a little bit, but we're gonna get this one started right now and get some points on the board with our first round. It's called Questions and Answers. It's pretty easy. I give the questions, you give the answers. Five points for a correct response. There's no penalty for an incorrect response. We'll just give the other team a chance at those points. All right, hands on buzzers, and here we go with a five-pointer. Which federal government program pays most of a senior citizen's health costs. Tom from Andrean. Medicare. Medicare is correct. Andrean on the board first in this game. When a teenager says legit, it's a shortened form of what longer word? Elijah from Merrillville. Legitimate. Yes, legitimate. Five points for Merrillville. You guys know how the game is played and we are tied. The beginning of this time period came in the mid 1300s and includes works by Joe. Tom from Andrean. The Renaissance? Yes, the Renaissance. Well, that was like a third of the way through the question. You nailed it. Nice job there, Tom. Five points for Andrean. You increase your lead, or you are in the lead, pardon. Tampa and Miami are the second and third largest cities by population in what U.S. state? Elijah from Maryville. Florida. Florida is correct. Back and forth we go. We're tied. Give the medical term for the process of moving skin from one part of your body to another. Tom from Andrean. A graft? Yes, that's correct. They call that a skin graft, and you're back into the lead, Andrean. What common food has types that include Gouda, Emmentaler, Kelechi from Andrean. Cheese. Cheese is correct. Five more for the Niners. You're up to 20. Name this Midwest state whose largest city by population is Wichita. Brian from Merrillville. Kansas. Kansas is correct. Merrillville up to 15 now. Which layer of air closest to Earth's surface is where our weather happens? Tom from Andrean. The troposphere? Yes, troposphere. Five more for Andrean. What first name was shared by the British poet Browning and the American poet Frost? Samaria from Merrillville. Robert. Robert is correct. Five points for the pirates. The Bass Strait separates this nation's province of Tasmania from its mainland. Name this country, who, Brian from Merrillville. Australia. Australia is correct. Iris Rock and the Aborigines, among many other parts of that clue. Nice job, Brian. Five more, and we are tied once again. Give the artsy term for a person who designs a dance sequence. Tom from Andrean. A choreographer? Yes, that is correct, choreographer. Five more. The notable children's book, Some Writer, tells of E.B. White, who used the phrase, some pig, in what novel? Miranda from Andrean. Charlotte's Web? Yes, Charlotte's Web, five more for Andrean. This country's Torres del Paine National Park is about 200 miles from its far southern city of Punta Arenas. Name this South American country much longer than it is wide. Samora from Merrillville. Chile? Yes, Chile is correct. Five points for Merrillville. You guys are up to 30 now. In Germany, Stalin 
is what dessert whose unpopularity in the US causes people to suggest it be used as a doorstop, a bomb, a bowling pin, or as next year's dessert instead? Tom, just in time, go ahead. Cake. Uh, I cannot accept that, sorry. Looking for fruitcake, as we are out of time in that clue. Fruitcake, disliked by many in the US. All right, here's another five pointer. The explorer Diogo de Silvas, who found the Azores Islands in the mid 1400s, was from what European country? Brian from Merrillville. Portugal. Portugal is correct, of course. Uh, Pedro Cabral, Prince Henry the Navigator, Ferdinand Magellan, also from there. Nice job, five points for Merrillville. Tied again, nice game for both teams here. The primary colors, blue and yellow, combine to make what? Elijah from Merrillville. Green. Green is right, five points there. For the orange side, up to 40 now. It was explored by Francisco de Ore Oriana. Francisco de Oriana, there we go. Who named it for the fierce female warriors he claimed to have fought, flowing through the world's largest tropical rainforest. Tom from Andrean. The Amazon River. That is correct. Amazon is worth five points, and that is the end of a great round of play. 40 points apiece in a back and forth match here. And many points coming in this game. Looking forward to the rest of the game. But let's put a bookmark in the contest right now and take a moment to meet our contestants. Starting on the Andrean side, and I'm talking to Kalechi, who is a senior at Andrean, and you're going to study biology at IUPUI next yep. year. All right. So what got you into biology in the first place? Well, I'm really interested in the science, science everything sounds like a child, and I plan to go to medical school after, so it's a good start for me. Awesome. You'll be Dr. Kalechi. Yeah. It's going to be great. <laughs> and you're, you also said you're a recorder prodigy. Yes. Like we're talking about the fourth grade instrument yes. that annoys parents everywhere. Yep. Pretty good at it, huh? Mm-hmm. I awesome. bring hot cross buns, a whole new meaning. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Good luck the rest of the game, Kalechi. Miranda is a senior at Andrean. You're going to attend the University of Rochester next year. Mm -hmm. how, did you, how did you land on that? Well, I really liked how flexible their programs were, how they have a cluster system. So instead of doing required classes, you just take from different types of classes. Mm -hmm. And I also liked their foreign language program since they have a lot of options there. You're going to study computer science mm -hmm. and Spanish. Yep. Awesome. Well, good luck with that. Glad you're here, Miranda. Good luck the rest of the game. Tommy is a senior at Andrean, and you're gonna attend the University of Notre Dame next year. Nope, that's you're Tom. not, that's Tom. <laughs> Tom, Tommy, Tom, yes. we'll talk to you in a minute. Tommy, <laughs> sorry, uh, you play soccer. That's Quiz bowl, and I don't mean to point, that's not polite. And part of the theater, you are gonna study at the University of Wisconsin-Madison. That's correct. Okay, so what, what attracted you to uh, Madison? Uh, I really like the campus, I really like the social scene. I thought it would be a great fit for me. Yeah, that's yeah. awesome. Well, good. Good luck with that. You want to study? Uh, uh, business. Business. Accounting. Okay. All right. Well, very good. Don't count what I just did there. <laughs> <laughs> Tom from Andrean yes. is going to study at, drumroll, Notre Dame next yes. year. So what are you going to do there? I plan on studying engineering. Awesome, yeah. awesome. So uh, you hope to be obviously an engineer of some yeah. type. Is there a specific part of that you want? Uh, I'm really interested in chemical engineering. Awesome. Yeah. Very good. Play tennis as well. I do. Yeah. Part of the theater, so you keep it's busy. Been fun. Yeah. Awesome. Well, good luck the rest of the game to the Andrean team. They are coached by Jay Price. All right. I'm gonna talk to Merrillville. Samaria is a senior at Merrillville High School, and you're a part of the band, right? And student broadcasting as well. Yes. So is this like a daily announcements kind of show, or? Um, we do have a morning show, but I am um, in our second, in our third hour. So it's just more of like we put together a Friday show every week. So sure. I put out, I um, film, edit, and put out Friday shows segments every week. You get to generate kind of original content then yeah. as part of it. Well, that's great. Good luck the rest of the game, Samaria. Elijah is a sophomore at Merrillville, and uh, you play tennis. Yes, I do. You enjoy photography as well. Mm -hmm. So uh, what kind of photography do you like to do? Oh, my favorite type of style, even though we're not in the city, is street photography. Sure. I just like capturing the candid moments because they're the ones that you really don't expect, so it's it my favorite. tells a story, and yes. you, want to, you want to get to know a little, little deeper into each of those stories, mm -hmm. right? Part of the band as well. That's a theme here on the yeah. Merrillville side. You play tennis, <laughs> is, and so you keep Keep pretty busy at Maryville High School. Yeah, I do. Good luck the rest of the game, Elijah. Thank you. Samora is a senior at Maryville. You enjoy running? Yes, I do. And reading? Yes. Do you have a favorite book? No, it's too hard, but I'm currently reading The Da Vinci Code, and I like the mystery. The Da Vinci so, Code? Yes. Nice. Did you like the movie when it was? I can't see the movie until I read the book. That's a, probably a good idea. Yeah. And uh, you're also ambidextrous. I am. Okay, so like, do you rub that in people's faces, or maybe um, you just don't realize how good of a thing that is? No, because like, people would be like, oh, you should write two things at once. I'm like, I 
kind of can't do that, but yeah. I understand. Yeah. Well, that's a good thing to have in your in life. Good. <laughs> good luck, Samora. The rest of the game. Brian is a senior at Merrillville, and you're a part of the band. Like I said, a yeah. theme here. Uh, you are a bowler. You're a bowler. I so, do. what is your high game, high series? Like, what are you? I've actually hit four 299s. I've never been able to achieve a 300. Four times <laughs> yes. you've been short of the perfect game. Yep. Does that really frustrate you? And oh, I don't let it get to me. I would. No. <laughs> you know what I would do? I would throw a heavy ball at something if that were the case. Well, that's great. Well, good luck the rest of the game to uh, the Maryville squad. They are coached by Melissa Sickinger. All right, back to our game at hand, which has been a good one and a tight one. You can see 40 points apiece on the board. Still five point clues in the second round that we call pop quiz. This is a pop quiz. It's no fun for anybody. It's a one on one competition. Brian versus Tom, Tommy versus Samora, Elijah and Miranda, Kalechi and Samaria. So, no conferring with teammates on this one. It's just down to you and the person you're across from. But still worth five points, no penalty for an incorrect response. We start with Tom and Brian. What word, starting with M, describes your first initial in cursive on a handkerchief or shirt pocket? Tom from Andrean. Moniker. Uh, it is not moniker. Brian? No guess here. They call that a monogram specifically. Sorry, Tom. Close, but no points there. Tommy and Samora, this one is for you. The inner core of Earth is made of which state of matter? Samora from Merrillville. Lava? It's not lava. Tommy, take a shot. Gas. Go ahead. Gas. It is not gas. It's a solid, actually, at the core. No points awarded there. Miranda and Elijah, here comes a five-pointer for you. In a short story by Edgar Allan Poe, what ancient Egyptian object is unwrapped and the person inside is still alive? Miranda from Andrean. A mummy. A mummy is correct. I have to tell you, I have this irrational fear when I go to the field museum that that's really going to happen because of this. Five points for Andrean. You're in the lead. Kalechi and Samara. I haven't grown out of it yet. That's true. All right. A gazelle is a fast-running mammal similar to a deer. Spell the word gazelle. Samaria from Merrillville. G-A-Z-E-L-L-E. -L -L -E. Yes, that's correct. G-A-Z-E-L-L-E. -L -L -E. Five points for Merrillville. And, of course, we're tied again. Would you expect anything less? Back to Brian and Tom. Which branch of social science studies, I'm sorry, which branch of social science, comma, studies money and how it works and is used? Tom from Andrean. Economics. Yes, economics. Fire for the air there. Five points for Andrean to Samora and Tommy. In an opera by this composer, a title character sings, I got plenty of nothing. Name this American composer of Porgy and Bess. That was George Gershwin with Porgy and Bess. Miranda and Elijah, a five-pointer for you. On what type of map are dry areas marked differently than rainy or snowy areas? Elijah from Merrillville. Physical? It's not physical in this case. Miranda? It's actually a climate map. Physical will be more some of the, you know, or the uh, you know, structures and things. Kalechi and Samaria for you, five-pointer. Complete this phrase from Article 3 of the U.S. Constitution. No person shall be convicted of treason unless on the testimony of blank witnesses to the same overt act or on confession in open court. How many witnesses? Are we in time? Yep. Samaya? Oh, dear. We're going to go with two. It was two, and if that was a guess, it was a really good one. Five points for Merrillville. Back to Brian and Tom for you. The words accurate, curator, sinecure, and pedicure all come from the Latin root cura, which means what four-letter word in English, Brian from Merrillville. Is it foot? It is not foot. I'll give Tom a chance to hear the rest of it. What four-letter word in English that is what a hospital patient receives from doctors and nurses? Go for it, Tom. Heal? It is not. It is care. Care and all those words. Accurate, curator, sign of care. Yeah, you get the idea. Tommy, Samora, for you. Which bodily structure is found in both mushrooms and fish? <laughs> 
skills can be found in both of those. Miranda and Elijah. The Disney movies based on this work add the character King Louis, who leads the wild monkeys and wants to learn how to make fire. Name this set of Richard Kipling stories that includes Miranda from Andrean. The Jungle Book. The Jungle Book. It doesn't include Miranda from Andrean, but that's right. Five points for Andrean, and you guys are up to 55, Kalechi and Samaria. The first one of these events in 1095 granted indulgence to those taking part in it. The third allowed pilgrims to visit the holy city again. Name this set of medieval religious wars waged by the Roman Kalechi from Andrean. The Crusades. The Crusades, yes, to take Jerusalem from non-Christians. Five points for Andrean, and you lead by 10. Brian, Tom, which organ of your body destroys your old and tired red blood cells? Tom from Andrean. Kidneys? It is not the kidneys. Free shot here, Brian. The pancreas? Not the pancreas, it was the spleen. Tommy and Samora. Its writer said, the history of the present king of Great Britain is a history of repeated injuries and usurpations, all having indirect object the establishment of an absolute tyranny. Identify this 1776 document, Samora from Merrillville. The Magna Carta. It is not the Magna Carta. I'm going to finish it for Tommy. Identify this 1776 document that ends... Tommy from Andrean. Common sense. Uh, it was not. It was the Declaration of Independence. We mutually pledged to each other our lives. That's all right. Everybody's upset at themselves for that one. No problem, though. It's a great game going so far. Andrean, after two rounds, with a 60 to 50 lead. Many points, by the way, coming up here to make up for that here in our third round. It's called Class Project. All right. This is group work if you want it to be. It's probably a little smarter to buzz in quickly, but you can talk to your teammates if you'd like. I'm going to read three clues that all point toward one answer. If you give me the correct answer after one clue, it's worth 30 points. That's a big score. 20 points after two, and 10 points if I read all three clues. Both teams can give it a shot at all three of those levels. All right, here we go. Point, uh, hands on buzzers. Social studies is the clue, and here's your 30-point clue. This state's town of rugby has a stone marking the geographic center of North America. Brian from Merrillville. Kansas. It is not Kansas. Miranda from Andrean. South Dakota. It is not South Dakota. Here's a 20 point clue, same answer. The Great Plains cover much of this state's western area, while the Red River Valley makes up most of its eastern half. Samora from Merrillville. North Dakota. North Dakota is correct. 20 points for Merrillville, and you vault into the lead by 10. Here we go. Three more clues, one answer. The category is science. 30 pointer. This chemistry theory was developed by Canadian Robert Gillespie and Australian Ronald Nyholm. Tom from Andrean. Ideal gas theory. Uh, that's incorrect. Maryville. 20 point clue, same answer. This theory says that atoms rearrange themselves to minimize the repelling force between electron pairs. Tom from Andrean. Vesper theory? Yes, that is correct. V-S-E-P-R, the valence shell electron pair repulsion theory. 20 points for Andrean, and you get those back. All right. Three more clues, one answer, last set in this round. Category is literature, 30 points. One of his short stories features endless hexagonal rooms in a library. Tom from Andrean. Poe? It is not Poe. Doesn't hurt to guess though. Saw what you did there. 20 point clue. In his story, Death and the Compass, a rabbi's death is investigated by Eric Lonro. Ten-pointer. He is the Argentine author of The Library of Babel and The Garden of Forking Paths. Tom, you're just in time. Go for it. Borges? That is correct. Jorge Luis Borges, 10 points for Andrean. Extend your lead to 20 as we head to our final round called Final Exam. 
Six categories, five questions each. You can see them up there on the board. They're worth 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30 points, respectively. We have to answer them in that order. The team that controls the board chooses the category. That's the team that answered last correctly in the game. However, the first choice is going to go to Merrillville since you trail by 20. So, Merrillville, give me a 10 point clue. You see the categories up there. Phrases. Phrases, a 10 point clue. This month of the year completes the phrase, as slow as molasses in blank. Miranda from Andrean. Winter. It is not winter. Brian from Merrillville. May. Not May, it was actually January for that phrase. Close though, Miranda, so you're going. We're looking for the month though. Merrillville, your choice. You can stay with phrases for 15 or you can go somewhere else. Uh, stay with phrases. Phrases, 15. This president gave us the phrases, I didn't inhale, I feel your pain, and don't ask, don't tell. Miranda from Andrean. Clinton. That is correct. Bill Clinton, 15 points for the Niners. You're up to 105. You control the board. What would you like to do? Elements. Elements, the category. 10 point clue there. This element combines with carbon to make butane. Tom from Andrean. Hydrogen. Hydrogen is correct. 10 more points for the Niners. 115, you control. Elements. Elements, 15, we stay there. Wood's metal contains a sizable percentage of this heavy metal used in x-ray shields. Le uh, <laughs> Tom from Andrean. Lead. Is that what you were going to say? Yeah. I hope so. <laughs> is that OK? I apologize that that just about popped out of my mouth. Yes, 15 points for Andrean. And you control the board. Elements. My mistake, yes. Elements, it is, 20 points there. Hemoglobin contains this metal used by red blood cells. Tom from Andrean. Iron. Iron is correct to carry oxygen through the bloodstream. You're on a roll. Andrean, you control. 20 more for you. What would you like to do? Elements. Elements, 25. This common metal is found with zinc in the alloy gunmetal. Copper. Andrean, you can wipe out the category with the 30 pointer or go somewhere else. Elements. Elements. Sure. 30 will end the category. First and last name needed. This native of Poland had a daughter, Irene, who won Miranda from Andrean. Marie Curie. Yet is correct. 30 points for Andrean. A big score there. You're up to a buck 80. What would you like to do? Um, let's go for some. Yeah, sure. Oh, phrases. Phrases. phrases, 20 points in that category. This two word phrase was used in the mid 1800s to refer to the obvious idea that the US was ordained to take over Tom from Andrean. Manifest destiny. That's correct, 20 points there. Any, any takers here on this side? No? I just heard a different sound. I want to make sure. Nobody buzz in. Okay, I gotcha. I'm making sure we didn't have an error there. Good. 20 points for Andrean, 200, and you control. Phrases, 25. Give the French phrase most commonly used to say, my name is. Miranda, Andrean. Je m'appelle. That is correct. Je m'appelle, 25. Andrean, you control. What would you like to do? Phrases. 30 will end the category in phrases. Complete this phrase from the poem, Twas the Night Before Christmas. Uh, Elijah from Merrillville. In all through the house. Uh, incorrect. I'll finish it for Andrean. From that poem, away to the window, I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters, and four words. Miranda. Threw up the sash. Yes, that is correct. 30 more points for Andrean. And you control the board. You have a sizable lead. What would you like to do? I got it. We'll go with Gov. I got it. Government? Government. You bet. 10 points there. Ruth Bader Ginsburg's book, I Dissent, tells of her years holding what legal position? Tommy from Andrean. Supreme Court Justice. That is correct. 10 more points for Andrean. You control. Government. Government, 15. This constitutional amendment prevents poll taxes being charged to voters. Tom from Andrean. The 24th. It is the 24th Amendment. 15 more. You control. You're up to 280. Government. 20 in government. This economic plan that helped rebuild Western Europe after World War II Tom from Andrean. The Marshall Plan? Yes, the George Marshall Plan. 20 points for Andrean. 
and you control the board with a minute to go in the game. Government. Government, 25 there. Joseph McCarthy became known for claiming that communist sympathizers were working at the U.S. State Department while he represented this Midwest state in the U.S. Senate. Tom from Andrean. Wisconsin. Yes, 25 more with Wisconsin, Andrean. What would you like to do? You can end government or go somewhere else. We'll end government. End you bet, 30 points in that category. Under presidential direction, this Commodore sailed his ships to Japan in 1853 and began, Tom from Andrean. Matthew Perry. Yes, from Friends, that's correct. 30 points <laughs> for Andrean. He was obviously not in Friends, that's an actor. Matthew Perry, the Commodore. You control, what would you like to do? We'll go with foreign films. Foreign yeah. films. Name the countries that are the settings for these films among the BBC's 25 greatest foreign films. That's for all of those in this category. Here we go. The 10 pointer, Seven Samurai. Kalechi, Andrean. Japan. Japan. Yes, Japan. We're naming the country. Ten points there. That's the end of the game by a score of 365 to 70. Andrean, you will advance to our semi-final round. A great game played by both teams. We were neck and neck there for a while. And good luck in everything you do here going forward, Maraville. Appreciate the fact that you are here today. We'll see you next time on Making the Grade. From safer communities. admirable performances. We power Northern Indiana so you can do what moves you.